So, okay, so I'm just going to apologise for my eyebrows in advance because they are very bad at the moment. I need them threading. I've said this in the past couple videos, but, you know. And if you see this palette, I'm using it as a mirror. As there are no mirrors in front of me at the moment, I'm literally just looking in my camera. And my camera is literally like five foot feet away from me. I am using a different lens today because I'm trying to basically record in daylight like i'm always recording at night i have a reason for that um i have a baby yeah she's loud so thankfully i mean <clears throat> unfortunately she's not here with us today <laughs> so let's get on with the video okay so i'm going to start off with my foundation um so you guys were saying to use just this by itself i'm telling you guys it's going to be too light for me i'm telling you you're saying that i'm a 420 trust me i'm not i'm sure i'm like a 440 at least and people are saying that this is too dark which is understandable before i do that i'm going to be using the maybelline ba baby skin instant pore eraser so i have really huge pores around my nose so i'm just gonna stuff this all in mate these pores gotta go this is so silky, I'm just going to moisturise my lips with it. <laughs> my lips are dry. Because I want this kind of to be like a rose gold kind of glistening kind of cute look. I've got this Get Glowed Illuminating Drops. I got sent this, um, I've never used it before. But the colour is like a rose gold kind of colour. I'm going to rub that into my skin. Interesting. I don't know what it's supposed to do but it just made my skin look a bit kind of like pink it's not really glistening that much let me see okay on with the foundations i'm gonna mix them using this color uh, i'm gonna use like three pumps of this and then like one pump of this one okay so this is what it looks like i've done what you guys said to use the 421 more it's come i don't know i don't know but yeah i'm just gonna keep going on so sorry if um you can hear cars going past you can hear people on the street my window's open i'm hot sorry i am using the contour stick in suede i'm gonna add a bit more than i did it last time to get that kind of really highlighted look okay so i did add a lot more than last time with this i think if you build up the concealer you do get a more highlighted look i'm now going to contour with espresso So now I'm going to set my whole face with this translucent powder. I've seen quite a few people using this now. Um, I don't know what it is. It looks like seasoning to me. To set my contour, I'm using my sleek contour kit. Alright, so now that the face is all done, I'm going to go in with this palette here. This is just some eyeshadow I got from Colourpop ages ago. Um, did it like this. I'm taking this brown kind of burnt orange kind of colour. I'm going to be taking this shade right here. Okay, 
and then I'm going to go in with this shade here. This is um, Teddy Bear from the Violet Boss palette. And I'm just going to put that in the crease of my eyes. So now I'm going to line my eyes with the NYX eyeliner. So whilst my eyelashes are drying, I'm going to take this MAC Mineral Light Skin Finish and the Morphe E2 brush and blend out my face and set it at the same time. Okay, so whilst that's drying, I never put my eyelashes on when they're dry. Like I like I like to put them on when they're like proper wet. So if you can see any white parts, then I'm sorry, my bad. So I'm gonna line my bottom waterline with this black pencil. This is from LA Girl. <laughs> Okay, so I'm then gonna set my whole face with this Mario. I don't even know how to say that second name. I just call him Mr. Mario. Mr. Mario facial spray with it's got aloe vera, herbs, and rose water. Um, this smells nice, so yeah. <laughs> and line my lips with this NYX pencil. This is in the shade Urban Calf. I'm using this NYX lip gloss. This is the Mega Shine lip gloss. Oh, it smells so nice. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Ah. Here we go, like that. Ah. Ah. Yeah. So I'm going in with MAC, um, MAC Raisin. For some reason, this eye keeps watering, so if you see, just if you can see this eye, it, it's just wet, then sorry, it's my eye, it's doing bits. So today I've got a chance to use this cinnamon by Rihanna, not Rihanna, by Fenty Beauty. Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna try it out today and see what happens. Yeah. So, I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna try and blend it out with my fingers. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it is a very, very cute colour. I love it. Okay, so this is a hair review, so I'm going to be right back um, and tell you about the hair. Okay, so I thought it'd be best to keep the hair in its natural state. Sorry that literally half my head is out. My stand is all the way literally up there. And it's either I stand up normal or I go down. But my knees are going to hurt, so I'm standing up, okay? This is four bundles, 26 inches of loose, loose wave, um, 18 inch closure. So you know loose waves with me. I love loose wave and I've never had it with a closure. So, and I must say, I do prefer loose waves with a frontal. The closure is kind of straight here and then it gets to like a little wave. Like it's really bugging me how it is. Um, the bushiness is definitely there. You can see this is the hair. I haven't even brushed it out or nothing. It's definitely there. This is not the best loose wave I've had, only because I don't like how the frontal is sitting on my head. It's annoying me. But um, yeah, let me show you the back. Um, the hair is nice. It's soft. It definitely is soft. Big. Um, all the hair forward. It looks like this. And they're really big curls. Um, if you like big hair then you know go for it but yeah there's nothing much i can say really this is west kissed hair so yeah if you've got any comments please comment them down below but thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video bye <laughs>